Okay, the redfish seat consists of four parts. The seat bottom, the hip pads, the seat back, and the seat back pedestal. To install this in your boat, simply slide the seat under, bend it down, but I want you to disengage the hip pads at this point. We don't want them tucked up underneath just yet. You need to center the seat, the center of the seat with the center of the boat, and then press it back as far as you can. And now the seat back pedestal is cut slightly taller than the height from the floor to the underside of the deck. So it has to compress to get underneath the deck. So press down, slide the seat back pedestal underneath the deck, and then with the butt of your palm, pound the seat back until it's in contact with the rear bulkhead. And double check to make sure the seat is centered and then compress the hip pads and slide them underneath the deck. It's that simple. Uh, the seat will not come out. It's pressure fit into place. You don't have to worry about it coming out, going down the highway or whatever. And to take the seat out, when you have to clean the boat, say you've got sand in there, it's just a reverse process. Disengage the hip pads, and then pull the seat out. But don't pull by the seat back. Try to get your hands behind the seat back pedestal and pull it out. Then once it pedestal clears the back of the combing, or back of the cockpit, then just bend the seat and pull it out. Very simple.